What is going on, nerds? It is me, Virtually Nerdy, here, and we are back playing Alien Isolation. And we left off just getting onto the... I don't remember what this place is called. <laughs> uh, Sevastopol Station. Sevastopol, that's what it is. Uh, anyway, let's continue reading what we did not read. Public notice of decommissioning of Sevastopol Station. We've had a long journey together, but sadly it's coming to an end. Siegen's, Siegen Court would like to take this opportunity to thank you all. Oh, Jesus. Sorry, I had an itch on my nose and I really focused on it. Siegen Corp would like to take this opportunity to thank all of you who worked and lived at Sebastopol over the years and, hope, uh, and hopes that Siegen has helped to make a productive and rewarding environment. Our investment and belief of the station has never wavered. Be assured that Siegson's Apollo Central AI and Working Joe asteroids will be there to serve Sevastopol until the last rivet is removed. We wish, all, uh, wish, we wish you all the very best for the future. After all, the Sevastopol isn't just a station, it's a people. Siegson Corp. Oh. I did need to go to that. Whoa. I'm going, I'm going. There's people. The hell? All right, hold on. I know they want me to go that way, but there's no way they're not going to just mention that. And they're not going to make me check, you know. Okay. All right. So, uh, I don't really know anything about Seekson. Um, that might just be a thing that, like, another sister company, very similar to the Wayland Yutani. Um, but my best assumption. Wayland Yutani bought Seekson Corp, and they bought the Sevastopol station and threw the alien on top of the station just to give it a test run. I don't know. All I know is Wayland Company's kind of a piece of shit. They're very, uh, um, you know, casualties are a, uh, casualties happen kind of people, you know? No use jorking my stuff over it. Just really like saying jorking it. It's funny. I like it. Picasso. Oh, that's pretty. Is it leaving? I'm here. I'm right here. We're late. Contact the Torrens. The hell's that? What the? Oh, they're closing the shutters. For what reason? Who knows? So there's a door open on this side. I don't know how to get to it. I'm hearing creepy sounds, dog, and I'm not much appreciating it. Okay, so that's broken. Did they have arcade games? Run around Rex. I don't know who that is. Ooh. Oh my gosh, can I actually play it? Oh. 
Yeah, I don't think I can play it. Oh! I am terrified. Okay. Okay, we're just gonna save just to be safe. Zoe, I'm sorry, but I don't I won't need you to come in next week. As you know, the store's been in trouble for some time now and I couldn't hold off the creditors any longer. There's just no one coming to Sevastopol anymore. And it's not just us either. It sounds like the whole station is in the red and they're pulling the plug. Going to sell it off for scrap. I guess I was speaking to one of, I was Wow. S they're going to sell it off for scrap, I guess. I was speaking to one of the engineers, and he reckons they'll announce it soon. I'm telling you so you don't have to stick around looking for another job. Sevastopol's finished. Time to move on. Harper. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I would like to continue. I want the lore. Oh, whoa. Shoot, have I been missing stuff? Uh, to all the space flight terminal employees, in the interest of public safety and the prevention of panic, it must be made clear to all potential passengers that there are currently no scheduled flights leaving Sebastopol, nor ships available. The Colonel Marshal are investigating the problems on station and will update accordingly from the office of the Marshal Waits. Uh, what is Apollo? Apollo is a central AI that monitors and provides guidance for all Sikhs and working Joes on Sevastopol. Apollo also oversees all communication on the station, so wherever, wherever you are, you know you're in safe hands. Sikhs in tomorrow together. What kind of cult shit was going on here at Sikhs and, dude? Oh. What? I don't know if I was supposed to go this way. This is interesting. I'm not falling for it. Those are just some squeaky lights. I naturally want to... I'm using a controller right now, so I naturally want to press B to uncrouch. But that is not the case. B is this, so... Sorry, I wasn't listening. I'll be 100% honest with you. What does it want me to use? What are you saying use? Okay, see, that was not clear at all. <laughs> I would have never gotten that. Oh, wait, there is something over here. Never mind. It is just light. I don't like creaking. It's so much noise for space. The only thing space had going for it was the fact that no one could hear you scream. Yet the building is screeching at me. <laughs> ah, fucking shit! What? What just happened? I don't even know! Christ! Oh my god, okay. Oh my god, I have so many horror games to get through and I'm not okay with it. Okay, okay, okay. Terminal? Nope. Okay, so we're not going to be dealing with any more lights than what I got. Uh-huh. All right. Ooh, those are body bags. What is this? Got to be the exit up ahead. A maintenance jack. Okay. Got to get the maintenance jack. 
is the only door I see. Do you have the Nostromo? Logs in your holding. Backup generator. Jork it off. Yep, 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 Okay, another maintenance jack. That's normal. That's normal. I feel like I'm looking down a lot, and I don't know if it's like a purposeful thing for me. Okay. Um, I, I feel like I'm like for some reason, like, looking down, because if I look up, that means I'm gonna get scurred. Plasma torch. Okay. I can't do jack shirt over here. Oh, yes, Susan B. Anthony! Fuck! What did I just say? What the fuck did I- wait, what? What did I say? Okay, I don't know why I screamed that name out. It is the first thing that came to my head. I just looked up who Susan B. Anthony was. <laughs> she's, she's an American woman's rights activist who, who was born in 1820. Why do I know who that is? I mean, like, good on her, you know? Like, I, I don't like how you're telling me to hide in something right now. I'll be honest. But I can't tell you why I know who Susan B. Anthony is. Like, pop off, queen. But I don't know why I know you. <laughs> History class really just came out of me. And, uh... I... <laughs> I had I'm gonna tell you right now guys I'm gonna die I'm gonna die in this game because I really just like came over and saw stuff dripping from the ceiling and looked up that is how people die in these movies in the alien movies I swear that is exactly how people die I swear it God, Susan B. Anthony really just got me all kinds of messed up. Oh, hey. Fuck. Oh, you got things that I need, dog. So I'm gonna come and loot you. There's blood in here. Oh. I detect. Maintenance jack. Ew. Okay.
This is weird, man. I'm confused. Like, so... It just feels weird. Why are there aliens here? You know? Why Why did the Xenomorph... How did it get on? Interview subject. Heist. Did I say that right? Heist? Look, if you can't even tell me your name, we're gonna be here a hell of a long time. I just wanna know about your boss. He's got you all into a lot of trouble. Someone's gonna be accountable. I'm gonna make damn sure someone's accountable. No? Tough guy, huh? Turner, turn off the tape. Maybe our friend here is just shy. They're gonna kick his ass. They're gonna kick his ass real hard. I honestly do not trust the fact that I have the jack and I can just progress now. I do want to see what was in this other room. Because I think I'm supposed to really come back here when I actually have stuff like the plasma cutter. But I can at least get right here because I have the maintenance jack now. So might as well. And who knows, maybe the plasma cutter is in here. Cap. Okay. So there's just a few things. I'm going to tell you right now, some of these, like, uh, secret rooms that have, like, supplies in them, supplies are kind of basic. Like, they're not great supplies. Ooh. I know my life is about to be made horrible. Stay still. Okay. Okay. Uh, turn around. Come on! Okay, we're just gonna... Just gonna cut out... I'm Ripley. There we go. Where'd you come from? Ripley! Off station. A ship. There's no ships! Here! There are now. Well, huh, that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something blue just now. Rocked this whole place. I saw it. But lady, that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something's on this station. Something you wouldn't believe. Like what? A killer. You get it? Okay. What's your name? Axel. I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Why? Because you seem to know your way around. I mean, why? What's in it for me? A place on the ship. How do I know I can trust you? I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. Go, sweetheart. Seek some comms is in the Systex bar. It's quite a distance, but we can get to a transit through the freight area. But watch yourself. We can get into all sorts of trouble here, okay? Well. Welcome, Axel. Is that you following me back there? Had to keep my distance. Can't take any chances. Yeah, see, I hear that, but I'm also curious what's going on here. Wow. Please tell me I get a flashlight. Stick close to me. What? Hey, don't move. Oh, okay, okay. We're not looking 
looking for trouble. Who are you? I'm John. This is Ringo. You're just some assholes. We haven't got time for this. Come on, Jana. We're trying to get to comms. Can you help us? We don't need their help. Don't tell them anything. Look, <laughs> I was just trying to get in. Jana, let's go. Okay? I, I'm sorry. Good luck. They're dead. What the hell was that about? Why are you so damn aggressive? Everyone's running shit scared. Keep them to their own. Safer that way. I can't run while Axel is here, and it makes me really wish for anything else at this moment. I hope this ship of yours is the real McCoy. The real McCoy? Speak like speak words dude i don't know what the hell a real what does that mean the real mccoy what does that mean Axel? let me get the elevator tell me allow me place is all needs a special touch i was so ready for an alien to be right there well what are you waiting for hit the button Keep the noise down here. There might be people around. I'd appreciate it if you told me what the hell was going on right now. Listen, Dan. When we get to the ship, we can kick back, braid each other's hair, and chat all you want. Yeah, when we get to my ship, I need to know what's going on right fucking now. Fine. Like I said, there's a killer. A killer? What does that even mean? I ain't seen it, but it's here. Picking us all one by one. What are you saying? A psycho? A person? No, something else. A monster. Thank you. I want that. Amanda really just doesn't seem to question. That's just bullshit, man. You should be looking for a way off. Are you crazy? There's no way off. At least we're safe down here. For how long? <laughs> what if they come for us? Then we shoot the crap out of them. Now shut up. You're making me nervous. I still think we need more supplies. Don't I? Can I get in here? Wherever we can find Trouble. Them. We'll have to go around them. Can I please? Axel, you're really making this boring for me. I'm gonna be honest. I don't like NPC follow missions. Friends of yours? I've had run-ins with those guys before. They don't like strangers. Even nice guys like me. I'm shocked. I ain't pulling your chain, darling. You want to go and say hello? It's your funeral. Those guns aren't for show. Someone should be doing something. They are. It's called surviving. I don't know if I mentioned it, but I really don't like the fact that I'm crawling through vents. It's like the alien's main mode of transportation, and I'm terrified. Okay. You've been living here? What can I say? My butler's on holiday. Grab what you need. I don't know when you'll get another chance. Yeah, fucking thanks, Axel. I really loved your one stick of glue over here. That was really helpful for me. I'll get down here for a week now, waiting for a ship. Waiting for you, I guess. Okay, hold on. I wanna see if I can craft it can get pretty dark I can only craft a med kit. Over there. <gasps> Wait! Sure up on okay, hold on. You see a flashlight? That is a headset. Oh, with a flashlight on it. Interesting. Just be careful not to flash it around. You don't want to get caught. Let's go. Uh, 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 Axel, Axel, hold on, hold on. I need to save it here so that I can actually, you know, end the episode. So, uh, yeah. We're getting, we're getting there. We're getting there. It's just, uh, I'm terrified. 
I'm terrified. I've been terrified of this game for so long. There's a very good reason I haven't finished it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Go check out Digital Illusion Podcast. Check out the Virtually Nerdy Discord. Uh, check out Dubby Energy. Use code Nerdy31 to get yourself 10% off. Thank you guys so much for watching. Keep being nerds, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Alien Isolation. Bye-bye.